slowly pass the years Seems like yesterday Childhood friends with us at play We shared so many smiles and tears Time just disappears Days become a blur We remember how they were It seems so swiftly past the years Friends pass on and seasons change But Jesus is the same One by one with time they fade Though timeless he remains Life is filled with tears What's around the bend? Jesus is our constant friend It seems so swiftly past the years Swiftly pass the years With them pass our friends On each we've come to depend We hold them in our hearts so dear Grief replaces cheer Jesus grants us grace Puts the smile back on our face It seems so swiftly past the years Friends pass on and seasons change But Jesus is the same One by one with time they fade Though timeless he remains Life is filled with fears What's around the bend? Jesus is our constant friend It seems so swiftly past the years Life is filled with fears What's around the bend? Jesus is our constant friend It seems so swiftly past the years So swiftly past the years Here we are on January 1st, 2020 You know, one of the great difficulties, perhaps great challenges of the calendar turning over in a brand new year is getting used to writing that new year on our correspondence and on our checks. How many do we have to destroy before we finally get it? My, I think about last year, 2020, and we had our themes and we had our hopes and had our dreams. But you know, uh, it didn't turn out exactly as we had hoped or as we had thought it might. Instead, we had a whole new set of challenges, and guess what? God's grace was sufficient and he brought us through. I'm wearing my celebration tie. It looks like an explosion. And I don't wear it very often, but this is a tie that, that says a mouthful. It says, we've got a lot to celebrate. Looking back, we have God's goodness for which to be thankful. Looking forward, we have so many hopes and dreams. And some of those will be realized. But whatever comes our way, God is in charge. You know that Moses is mentioned throughout the Bible and even in the Psalms a number of times the psalmist writes about Moses' leadership and leading the people. What a man he was. What an example. What a role model. But there is one psalm that he wrote. We've been there before. It's Psalm 90. And in Psalm 90, what piece of advice, what 
inspired wisdom does he give us? In verse number 12, he says, so teach us to number our days. Number our days so that we may apply our hearts unto wisdom. Wisdom, of course, doesn't come with us automatically. Wisdom is seeing this world through God's eyes. Wisdom is taking up God's word and applying it. He enables us to do that. He gives us inspired truth. We then believe it. We act upon it. And he helps us as we step out. 2021 is going to be every day taking that step with Jesus, walking by faith applying our hearts to wisdom. I trust that we will. I don't know what challenges are on your mind right now, but keep an open mind and keep an open heart and allow the Lord to work and do in us what He wills. You know, there are so many, so many things, so many areas of our life that we still need to turn over to the Lord. And I'm saying to you right now, we don't know exactly what's around the bend, but as I've sung, Jesus is our constant friend. It seems so swiftly past the years. Let's pray. Father, we thank you for the folks joining us today on this first day of the year for From the Shepherd to the Sheep daily devotional. Thank you, Lord, for what Moses, by inspiration, wrote about numbering our days. We need to be taught to do that. We need to be told, Lord, every day that this is a high priority and we need to apply our hearts to wisdom. Help us today to do that. With our heads bowed and our eyes closed, it may be that you've never trusted Christ as your Savior. Right now, will you call upon Him? Ask the Lord Jesus Christ into your heart. Pray something like this. Dear God, I admit that I'm a lost sinner. I need a Savior. And right now, I receive the Lord Jesus Christ into my heart as my personal Savior. Please take away my sins and take me to heaven when I die. And if you prayed that prayer, let us know. We'd love to rejoice with you. And all you soul winners out there, keep on winning souls during this year and throughout the years to come. Father, right now we do remember those who are in pain, those who are facing uh, imminent challenges, and those who are disappointed. Lord, you are the solution. You are still the answer. And I pray that all during this year we may look to you. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. Swiftly past the years, it seems like yesterday. Childhood friends with us at play, we shared so many smiles and tears. I can remember them now. And how time just disappears Days become a blur We remember how they were It seems so swiftly past The years God bless you today. You are listening to From the Shepherd to the Sheep Daily Devotionals. This is a ministry of Central Baptist Church in Woodbridge, Virginia. If you would like to learn more about our ministries, you can find us online at cbcwoodbridge.org. You will also find many other helpful resources there, including preaching, devotionals, and songs. We thank you for listening to this devotional, From the Shepherd to the Sheep.